This is an impression of a trying musical at home and the various types of singers I happen to hear contribute to the program. Firstly, a gay little lady, just a mass of pearls and Pekingese, sang about the cuckoo. Her husband thought she was, but really she'd had so much wine in her trifle that she hooked before she cooked. followed by a very bogus Italian tenor who hailed direct from Milan <clears throat> via Huddersfield. Then, after much persuasion, dear old Mrs. Frutalberry was allowed to sing. Poor old grandma, she'd been singing the same song since the Crimean War. I stood on the bridge at midnight When the clock was striking the hour And the moon shone o'er the city when the hostess herself, Lady Stagnant Waters, an ex-operatic soprano, consented to sing. <laughs> oh, just yes, George, you're always bothering me to sing, you know. <laughs> the last time I sang was in that charming old opera, Soust. Oh, Mr. George, dear, I do wish you'd been at my last wedding. <laughs> there were so many guests there that they cut me instead of the cake. What? Mayfair? Skunk? Ah, yes. I divorced the one I had last year, Sir George. But I'm still a gay little widow of the old school, George, dear. Ah, uh, yes, I've worn out many a feather ball in my day. But if you persist, I'll sing a little aria. But I must just try my voice. Ah! <laughs> Bridget, put that parrot out of the room. It's eating all the nuts off the trifle and picking the kernel on top of it. <laughs> Excuse me, Sir George, one old bird in the room's enough, eh? I'll sing the laughing song from Manon Lesko. Thank you, Dr. Raymond. Oh, hear my tail diverting of how they won't quit flirting of commissary for a ha 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 His men were so knit portly it is his bosom portly there lay a heart of good ha 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 He loved a maid of the ha 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 and sought a handkerchief ha ha He gave a welcome called ha 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 You wonder what his name is Ulysses Oleander or Gallant Romeo <coughs> His name Shall I declare it? And in a whisper, say it. So, 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 like this. <laughs> no, 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 I must not tell. <laughs> 
Finally, the evening closed with a duet by those people who will sing old English folk duets, such as Twas a Plover and Its Egg by P. Witt. On yonder hill there stands a creature Who she is I do not know I'll go and wait her for her beauty Will she answer yes or no? Then I will stay with you forever If you will not be unkind Oh dear madam, would you have me? Would you have me change my mind? Oh no, John, no, John, no, John, no No, hark, I hear the church bells ringing Madam, will you be my wife? Oh, dear madam, have you settled to live single all your life? 